The ride of your life. The deal of the year. Lease a premium signature series Lincoln Town Car. Lincoln. What a luxury car. Should be. I found this rather long piece of Americana sat rusting on the side of a main road. It sat in the yard of an empty building that was once a roadside cafe and looks like it's been used more recently as a transport office of some kind. The yard outside is enclosed by a wall of large freight trailers that looks something like a 21st century version of a settler's wagon from the American West. Sat in the middle of those trailers is this, a Lincoln Town Car stretch limousine. These are pretty much the only time you're likely to see a Lincoln branded vehicle on British roads as Ford have never marketed Lincolns here and all these limos are imports, complete with the steering wheel being on the wrong side. This one looks like it's in pretty sorry condition but I did give the tyres a kick just to make sure, yeah it's good, and it was definitely still a good opportunity to take some pictures. Although there's a fair amount of smashed glass on the inside, the rest of the interior was actually in pretty decent nick, and as it started raining, it was a good opportunity to have some fun with some interior shots. Don't worry, I didn't actually drink from that glass. As for the Lincoln Motor Company's history, it was founded in 1917, and it's named after Abraham Lincoln and not a cathedral city in the UK's East Midlands. It became part of Ford in the 1920s, where it's been a popular US brand ever since. As for stretches like this though, they're not so popular anymore, as they're seen as a bit tacky. And the rich tend to get chauffeured around in more understated SUVs. They were briefly popular in the mid noughties for proms and hendus, but there were issues with them being incorrectly licensed and poorly maintained, with at one point police claiming that over 65% of the ones stopped were found to be illegal or unsafe. This seems to be an international theme as well, as there was a serious crash in 2018 in Skohara, New York, that resulted in the death of 20 people due to a hired stretch limo that had poorly maintained brakes and had been carrying 18 people when it was only certified to carry 10. It had also failed two inspections and was being operated by a driver who was not licensed to carry that many passengers. That particular incident did make international news and may well have been a factor in the decline in the stretch limo hire business. Well, if you enjoyed that video, check out this one up here, but for now, thanks for watching.